The French Grand Prix's place on the F1 calendar is under threat, infuriating Esteban Akan who said he'd do everything to prevent it being scrapped. The F1 calendar could be in for a big shake-up in 2023 if reports are to be believed. The historic Belgian Grand Prix will be axed from the 2023 F1 calendar to make room for a return to South Africa, it was reported last month. It is also believed that the Circuit de Paul Ricard, which hosts the French Grand Prix, could also go. According to De Telegraph, F1 bosses are planning to run 24 races next year, which would be a new record for the sport. And with new venues being added to freshen up the schedule, the Belgian and French Grand Prix are set to be axed. F1 is also holding a race in Las Vegas next year. The U.S. already has two races this year, one in Miami and one at the Circuit of the Americas in Austin, Texas. French driver Esteban Acon was not happy when he discussed the possibility of his home Grand Prix being axed. In April, he said he will do everything he can to prevent this from happening. The Alpine driver said, I'm very happy to discover new tracks but yes, to see the French Grand Prix at threat, definitely I will do everything I can to be vocal on that. I will do everything I can to keep it on the calendar. When I started Formula One, the French Grand Prix was not there. It was rumored that it was going to come back, and it did. We've lived so many good moments with the French fans there and yeah, it's extremely special when we go there every last month. F1 expert Albert Fabrega claimed that the spa Frankerchamps circuit in Belgium is at risk. Given the track's immense history in the sport, many fans have expressed anger at the idea. The current F1 world champion, Max Verstappen, feels the same way. Speaking this week, the Red Bull driver said, it would be a big shame to lose spa. It's my favorite track in the world. World and also with the recent changes they did to the runoff and stuff, I think it's just an amazing track in a Formula One car, any car to be honest, with all the high-speed corners and the flow it has in general, Ferraris Carlos Sainz added, I think there's a compromise to be found, because in the end, I think we all love going to France, to Spa but at the same time the sport is growing so much, I guess there's a lot of new places that are paying quite a lot of money to be part of Formula One. And it's difficult, as a business point of view, to say no to that. I think the best compromise would be to do rotation and I understand France or Spa maybe cannot afford to be in the calendar every year but I hope that at least every two or three years we can visit Spa in a Formula One car. I just wish that even if Vegas, South Africa, whatever is coming, that we can still go to back to France or back to Spa every now and then to keep enjoying those kinds of circuits.